The cutter is safe to operate if you follow a few common sense procedures. Never turn on the cutter if anyone is around you or distracting you. Never put your hands under the cutter blade. If you feel uncomfortable operating the cutter, ask a supervisor to help you or to make the cut for you. Be sure the machine has stopped before you take your hands off the buttons to retrieve your material. Before you turn on the cutter, make sure that the area around you is clear, no one is around you or distracting you. All of your attention should be on the task of cutting. Using the bed depth adjusting wheel, set the bed to the size of your cut you want to make. The wheel locks and unlocks. To the left is unlocked, to the right is locked. Unlock the wheel. Set it to the measurement that you need. Turn it to the, to the right to lock it. Handling your material from the back, place your material into the machine, never putting your hand under the cutter blade. Square your material from the back and the side without getting your hand under the blade. Turn the machine on. Wait until the machine reaches an even tone. When it's an even tone, that's the perfect operating speed. You've set your material, no distractions around you, you're ready to make your cut. Both thumbs on each green button, you want to press them at the same time and hold them down until the cycle is completed with the cutter. If you let go of the cutter before the cut is complete, the blade will stop. To complete the cut, you have to release both the buttons and repress them both at the same time. That will finish the cycle of the cutter. Be aware that if the blade stops on its way down, that it will continue its cycle down before it comes back up. Once you've taken your hands off the buttons, pause for a second to make sure that the cutter is completely stopped. At all costs, do not reach into the cutting area to retrieve your material. To retrieve your material, release the wheel brake, move your material towards you using the bed wheel. Then you can retrieve your material without having to put your hands underneath the blade.